Welcome back to Market Matters. I'm Jonathan Gunn with Nadia Hassan today. And for our stocks with momentum, we have a positive momentum stock for you today. And uh, it's not too common that you see MISC Berhad. Basically, we picked this stock today because we think you're all already jaded with furniture stocks. Because again, uh, some of those lists are heavier board and caring, which uh, yeah. we all know. John doesn't like caring. He doesn't shop at caring. He shops at Guardian, <laughs> essentially. Well, uh, on but MISC... Wow, when I saw this, I'm like, positive momentum, that's what they think it'll do. Up already today by about 2%. Correct. Uh, so, Nadia, MISC Berhad basically, uh, on the news front, uh, last month it actually entered into agreement to sell its 50% stake in uh, VTTIBV. Uh, it's what a mouthful. A, yeah, that's BV, true. The BV is actually British Virgin Islands, I think. Right, I, I think so. So, uh, it's a uh, provider of energy storage uh, worldwide solutions. So uh, basically, uh, a, a lot of the analysts have come up to say that uh, the deal is actually positive for MISC and they say that uh, the sale uh, translates to about 1.28 times its book value. So that'll be an interesting thing, right? I was looking at MISC in general and whether you agree with this or not, it's a good company but you don't feel good about oil and gas. Do you feel that oil and gas at this point still is worth an entry? I mean, shouldn't you pick it up when it's kind of cheap? It, it is kind of cheap, but uh, the thing is that uh, uh, the, the industry in general is plagued by lower charter rates and, you know, because there's so much competition, we, we don't know actually what, what is the visibility of oil at this point in time. Now. Well, okay, talking about charter rates, most people actually thought that the Iranian deal, remember that famous deal that actually right. President Obama, who's apparently somewhere with Bear Grylls now, actually signed, he said that it actually would help with the charter rates because it means tanking is going up. And the thing is, I think competition is good. I don't see why you feel there's some kind of bogeyman. Because if you, or I put it this way, in terms of competition, you just have to be better than the next guy. That may be true, but looking, at, uh, the com looking into the details of the company's quarterly report, they said that, uh, as I mentioned again, competition uh, is expected to be rife in its heavy engineering business because uh, although it's actually uh, bidding for several uh, projects, the company acknowledged that aggressive competition is going to Don't probably it's hinder good... its prospects. Don't you think it's a good company? I, I agree that it's a good company because uh, it, it's very stable. It, uh, it, it is very good at making deals. But uh, whether the, the current climate is facilitative for, for its growth is could be called into question at the moment. Nadia. It's come off its high. It's 8.40 now. It was 8.98, oh, sorry, 8.98, yes, right in April. So why not? I mean, it's positive momentum, which means the edge research thinks that with the algorithm applied, it will actually move more. Well, and to move something like MISC, ain't no small task. Well, to sum up, I think both of us agree that MISC is a good company, but uh, of course, the question really is uh, whether the, the current market is facilitated for its growth. 